Hey guys, so right off the bat I'm going to tell you I didn't really edit this uh, video because I'm going to make it a little longer so I can have some time to talk. Um, kind of give you guys an update on what's going on because I'm going to make some changes probably. Um, so there you see me doing 210 or 215 on the clean. I don't remember. I think it was 215 and only one rep. And then I do my deadlift. So what happened here is I actually kind of got hurt on Monday from doing squats. Um, and so I couldn't do the deadlift quite right because uh, my lower back has been giving me some issues. So what ended up happening is on the first rep, like I couldn't even get it up. And then I was like, you know what, fuck it. I have to at least get one rep today. It's like I, I have to get at least one. And uh, I did manage to get it. Uh, two reps, but I feel like I could have gotten more, just my lower back was kind of bothering me, and also I couldn't get tight enough, because I know I could have gotten at least uh, three or four reps on this, if uh, I was feeling good, and since that day, my lower back still been giving me some issues, so that's another thing that I'm considering on um, why I might not go straight into uh, another 531 cycle. I might just, because uh, right now I'm taking a deload week, and what I might do next week is if I'm feeling good, I'll do some maxes, and then I'll switch programs into a three-day-a-week program. Uh, I think I have a video on it, a uh, three-day-a-week bodybuilding program. I'm going to switch over to that, kind of more to give my body a break, uh, also give me a mental break so that I can uh, get more motivated to go to the gym again. Not that I really need any motivation, but um, I just want to do something different, too. Uh, and I think it would be a little fun to, to do it at least for uh, two months or so. Here I do 295 for five. These felt pretty easy. I did them before, and I wasn't supposed to because um, my training matches are messed up. But you'll see another video that I have um, also 295 on there. Although I will say that this time they felt a lot better than last time I did them. They moved a lot faster. Uh, last time I got stuck on like the last rep. This time I just powered through it. It was really easy. Uh, next is my overhead press. Uh, it's 160 for... I think it was only two reps. And again, I could have gotten a third rep, but like my lower back just wasn't feeling so good, so I didn't want to push it. Because um, like, if you lift weights for a long time, you'll notice that any little thing that you like mess up, like even if you break your pinky, it'll mess your lifts up because your body just functions as a whole unit. It's like you, you can never um, one little piece is broken, the rest of the body is broken too. That pretty much how it is. Like, I, I smashed my ankle once, and then I couldn't squat for shit because my ankle hurt too much. Um, this kind of same deal, lower back hurt. Uh, it, it doesn't prevent me from lifting. Obviously, you saw me lifting pretty uh, well on my deadlift day, and my back was still kind of hurting, but, like, I don't want to push it, and if I keep West 531, I'm going to be lifting heavier loads because, uh, the next load I have for squats are uh, 435 for 5, and then deadlifts would be uh, 395 for 5. So that's quite heavy for me. And all I could do it, I think it'd be better to um, probably avoid doing that. So like I said, I might just go out and map, uh, see where I'm kind of at. And I won't, like, truly, truly match, like, push myself to my limits, because, one, the gym equipment here, it, it, it kind of sucks for that. Because, um, like, the leverages, like, here you, you see me, like, the bench is a little lower than I'd want it to be. It should be a little bit higher if I wanted to get a good lift off. Same thing with the squat. It's a little bit too high for me to get a good lift off to uh, get the bar really set in my back real nice. But, nonetheless, I'll probably match and uh, probably go on to the next program based off of that.
I'll decide what I'll do after this deload week, see how I'm feeling next week. If I'm feeling good, I'll keep with uh, one more cycle of 531, if I can still manage that. Otherwise, I'm going to go into maxes. Anyways, like the video if you liked it. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already, and leave a comment in the comment section uh, what you think.